welcome you back all you amazing scientists. Today we're going to be looking at atoms, molecules and compounds. If you would like to make notes about your learning, you'll find a link to this organiser in the description panel below. Let's learn about atoms first. Atoms are made out of things called protons, neutrons and electrons. Different atoms have a different number of protons, neutrons and electrons. Let's take a closer look at a couple of atoms. The helium atom. You can see here that the helium atom has two protons and two electrons. It can have one or two neutrons. However, the hydrogen atom, you can see here, has one proton and one electron. Now remember, all good scientists question, inquire and wonder. Take some time. Can you think of any questions you might have about atoms, molecules or compounds? Write these down or share them with a friend. Right, let's take a look at wonderful molecules. Molecules are made when atoms combine. To make a molecule, two or more atoms have to be chemically combined. The molecules can only consist of one type of atom. The molecules are joined by covalent bonds. Right, let's take a closer look at a couple of molecules. The hydrogen molecule, H2, is when two hydrogen atoms have been joined by a covalent bond. The oxygen molecule, O2, is when two oxygen atoms have been joined by up to two covalent bonds. Just a reminder, that molecules can be made up of more than two of the same atoms or elements. For example, the ozone molecule is made out of three oxygen atoms. Now let's take a look at compounds. Compounds are different than molecules because when compounds are made, they are made of different types of atoms joining together. Compounds have to have two or more different atoms and they are held together by ionic attraction. Let's take a look at a couple of common compounds. Water, H2O. You can see here that it has one oxygen atom and two hydrogen atoms that are joined by ionic bonds. Carbon dioxide, CO2, has one carbon atom and two oxygen atoms joined by ionic bonds. If you haven't done it already, I would now take some time to question, inquire and wonder. Think about what you've learned and what questions you have that you need answered. Let's take a quick recap of what we know about atoms. Atoms are the building block of all matter. Atoms make up molecules and compounds. Each atom is unique. It has its own number of protons, neutrons and electrons. Let's recap what we know about molecules. Molecules are made out of atoms. Molecules are made when two or more of the same atoms are joined by covalent bonds. Molecules are made when two or more atoms have been chemically bonded. Let's recap compounds. Compounds are made out of atoms. Compounds are made when two or more different atoms are joined together. Compounds are formed when two or more atoms are held together by ionic attraction. Important. Just remember that the learning in this lesson is just like an atom. It's a very small part about a massive topic. If you'd like to learn more, go to my next lesson around states of matter. Ka kite anua. See you again.